Today's sunshine note is titled, Ready or Not, Therefore Keep Watch, Because You Do Not Know the Day or the Hour, Matthew 25, 13. The day of my 16th birthday dawned perfect with a rare and unexpected surprise, rain. Because we lived in Phoenix, we got a good rainstorm only a couple times a year. I hoped all day I'd get to enjoy the rain properly, but it was a busy day and I didn't get an opportunity until my best friend Brooke and I were standing under the eaves in the parking lot, waiting for my parents to take us to my birthday dinner. There in the parking lot, dozens and dozens of shimmering rain puddles just begged to be jumped in. We took one look at each other, and the puddle jumping began with a shout. In the gray, rainy evening, we splashed happily through puddle after puddle as if we were five years old again. It was the most fun either of us had enjoyed in months. We were tired with laughter by the time my parents drove up, honking hurriedly. Come on, they shouted. We're going to be late. Jump in quick. But that was before they got a good look at us, sloppy, soaking wet and covered in mud, not suitable for any birthday dinner anywhere. We ran back to the dorm to change our wet clothes, but there was no help for us. We were late. It would be a real shame to get caught playing in the mud when Jesus finally does come again, wouldn't it? But that could happen. Some of you are jumping through the dirtiest habits as if nobody is coming for you, as if there's nowhere better that you're supposed to be. Jesus told a parable about ten girls waiting up late at night for a bridegroom to arrive so they could go to the party. Five of them brought extra oil for their lamps, and five did not. When he finally did come, the latter were unprepared and had to go back to town to buy more oil. The doors to the party were closed, and they did not make it into the wedding banquet. The thing is, if they had known when he was coming, they would have been ready, right? Maybe that's why Jesus doesn't tell us when he'll return. Maybe he wants us to be ready every day of our lives. The truth is that none of us knows when our last day on earth might be. How are you living today? Are you prepared for his coming or are you messing around in places you shouldn't be? If he came tonight, would he find you ready or unprepared? May God bless you today.